Only recently has the notion reemerged that cellular metabolism can regulate stem cell behavior. Our study investigates the role of AMP kinase as a metformin responsive metabolic pathway in guiding fate specification and maturation of the acid secreting gastric parietal cells, thus implicating AMPK in the differentiation of gastric epithelial progenitors. Upon discovering that genes in the AMPK pathway were enriched in the parietal cell population, we sought to identify metformin targets in the gastric epithelial progenitors versus mature parietal cells using gene set enrichment analysis of wild-type mice and mutant mice with parietal cell-specific loss of AMPK treated with or without metformin. As expected, in wild-type mice containing both metformin-responsive progenitors and mature parietal cells, the top gene sets enriched with metformin treatment were associated with energetics including oxidative phosphorylation and electron transport chain. More excitingly, in the metformin-treated mutant mice, containing only the metformin responsive progenitors, the top enriched gene sets were associated with development and differentiation. Microarray analysis further revealed that other transcriptional regulators, including HDAC5, FOXO3, and the transcriptional factor KLF4, known to regulate stem cell proliferation, were most highly enriched in the metformin-treated mutants, aka the progenitor population. To further explore the role of AMPK in the gastric progenitors, we examined ismal proliferation and parietal cell census in the mutant mice treated with or without metformin in the context of injury. If AMPK truly functions in the progenitor population to guide parietal cell fate specification, metformin should still be able to influence proliferation and parietal cell number, despite loss of AMPK in parietal cells. Lo and behold, metformin was able to do just that decreasing proliferation, and increasing parietal cell number even in the mutants. Parietal cells are shown here in red. These changes, though modest, were statistically significant. Metformin treatment of mutants was not able to normalize parietal cell size, nor nuclear localization, features associated with parietal cell maturity. Furthermore, Western blot analysis displays increases of KLF4 with metformin treatment, supporting it as an AMPK target. These results indicate that AMPK functions not only in terminally differentiated parietal cells to regulate maturation through PGC1-alpha, but also in the gastric epithelia progenitors through KLF4 to promote parietal cell fate and regulate cell lineage allocation. Understanding molecular mechanisms that regulate parietal cell differentiation could be vital in developing therapies for gastric conditions such as autoimmune gastritis or gastric adenocarcinoma in which parietal cell loss may contribute to disease pathology.